Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, Throne and Liberty News. Let's check what is happening on servers in Korea and also regarding global release of Throne and Liberty. Before we start, let me just say subscribe to my YouTube channel to see more of Throne and Liberty videos in the future. First, let's start with the news from Korea and I can tell you this evening will be huge on Korean servers. You can see here in front of me, big update will come on servers in Korea on May 8. Two things are really huge regarding this update. First thing here, balance between weapons. Developers of this game, NCSoft, they have decided to completely change balance between weapons. They will nerf, they will nerf really hard dagger and crossbow and they will buff longbow, wand, staff, greatsword and sword and shield. Check a dedicated video on my YouTube channel from two days ago where I go into details regarding all the details what they will change specifically for each weapon. In general, yes, they are nerfing dagger and crossbow, good decision. They still didn't nerf what is interesting, passive skills of the dagger, which is actually one of the strongest side of the dagger weapon, which is good for everybody who will maybe play dagger as a main weapon. But they have in general, yes, they have nerfed dagger and crossbow and they have buffed a little bit wand, staff and longbow and also they have buffed a little bit sword and shield regarding aggro. They want to make easier for everybody who is playing sword and a shield as a main weapon in combination with some other weapon to have a roll of the tank. They wanted to make easier tanking of some hard bosses. Regarding greatsword also a little bit of buff. Like I said check dedicated video on my youtube channel from two days ago where I go into details regarding each weapon. This is crucial update very important update and possibly final polishing of the game, final adjustments regarding balance between weapons before global release. Is it possible that we will see this balance already in global version of the game for release? Maybe, who knows, we will see. Another big change coming on May 8 is regarding local and regional events. I have already done two videos on my YouTube channel, guides regarding local and regional events of Throne and Liberty. They are very important. They are very important because by playing these events, you are getting parchment. Parchment is one of the materials which you will use later to craft skill books and those skill books you are actually using to upgrade your skills. So this is very important part of end game content and already basically during leveling process you'll be introduced into local and regional events. Now they are completely changing local and regional events gameplay. They are making it PvP faction type of events. How will everything function? I will let you know about that on my YouTube channel when I actually play these events after May 8th, after tomorrow. I need to try to play them. Actually this is really huge change. Also, there is possibility that we will see all of these changes, including local and regional events, one day in the future in global version of the game. So, May 8th update, absolutely massive over there on service in Korea. What other changes we'll have in that update, that remains to be seen. I will let you know about that instantly here on my YouTube channel. If you want to see some gameplay of Throne and Liberty from servers in Korea, visit me on Twitch. I'm live streaming every evening about 6 p.m. Central European time. I'm live on Twitch. If you have any kind of questions regarding the game, join me on Twitch during live streams. I'll be glad to answer and also to keep you updated regarding everything what is happening in the world of Throne and Liberty. Just to let you know for this evening or there on servers in Korea, big update coming regarding the changes, nerfs and buffs regarding weapons and also these changes regarding local and regional events. Another opportunity for everybody who likes to play PvP, you can play these local and regional events every three hours. That is if they will not change the schedule. We will check about that. Now, regarding global version of the game, let's talk about this. I know that you are expecting some kind of news, maybe release date. For this evening, I don't have for you any kind of release date for global version of the game. It should happen this year. Yeah, it should happen during 2024. We all know that global closed beta test is over. That happened on April 17. After that, complete silence from Amazon games. Nothing officially, even unofficially. There are no any kind of leaks. I mean, NDA is up regarding global closed beta test. And also we didn't see any kind of leaks or any kind of official information from Amazon games. I think they are waiting for this. 
they are waiting for Summer Game Fest. This is a big gaming event, which will be up on June 7th. We have already heard information from developers of New World. They are preparing big, big announcement regarding New World, what it will be regarding PvP or maybe New World coming to consoles. That remains to be seen. However, there is also chance, big chance, that we will get a release date, global release date, finally announced on Summer Game Fest. We all know that Amazon Games loves this event and also in the previous year they were participating in Summer Game Fest. So we need to wait, at least in my opinion, June 7th. Maybe there is possibility that you'll get a release date sooner, but I highly doubt so. June 7th, it's in one month. 30 more days until this big event and then possibly, probably, we'll get a release date. If we don't get a release date on Summer Game Fest, then we are in big problems. Big problems, that means probably release of the game on the end of the year. Maybe October, maybe November, September, I don't know, probably end of the year. I can show you also here on official Twitter account of Throne and Liberty, there is nothing new since April 17. I'm covering all the news, I'm following everything what is happening, also I'm checking daily few times actually, not only daily, few times per day, what is happening on Steam database, maybe some kind of changes here regarding change list, regarding history here, uh, database, right? That is nothing new. Maybe some kind of changes could indicate here regarding Throne and Liberty files that something is happening, but you can see for last 29 days, completely silent. In the meanwhile, while we are waiting, global release announcement from Amazon Games, Check my YouTube channel. I already have more than 200 videos on my YouTube channel. Actually, I can show you here on this playlist alone. I have 215 videos regarding Throne and Liberty. If you are interested into different kind of in-game features, guides for new players, updates and news, check my YouTube channel. I'm also preparing lots of content before global release of Throne and Liberty. Thank you for watching the video. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Follow me on Twitch. I am live streaming every evening about 6 p.m. Central European time. Join me on Twitch every evening. I'm playing mandatory. I didn't miss even one day playing on servers in Korea since release day, since December 7, 2023. Yes, I'm playing every evening. So join me on Twitch. If you have any kind of questions regarding the game, I'll be glad to answer. For this evening, just to let you know, over there on servers in Korea, big changes are coming to the game. I will let you know regarding all of these changes, how are they actually functioning in the game. I will also try to play these local and regional events on new way. You will see some gameplay footage. And regarding global release of Throne and Liberty, I'm guessing that Amazon Games, well, they're waiting for this. Summer Game Fest 2024, June 7th. Mark your calendars, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. If we don't get a release date at this day, yeah, probably then end of the year release of the game. But I'm hoping we will get a release date here on Summer Game Fest. When I see anything new and interesting is happening in World of Throne and Liberty, I will let you know about that instantly here on my YouTube channel. For this evening, you are fully updated what is happening in World of Throne and Liberty. Thank you for watching the video. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Follow me on Twitch. And see you soon with another Throne and Liberty video.